than pessimistic. Let's be realistic when Queso spitting. Man, he always hitting. I'm Scotty Pippen against the Pistons. Too proficient. They flopping, flipping. Larissa Pippen. J Hus Drake, who told you? My last J Hus reaction is exclusively on my Patreon for now because I got blocked. So go join the Patreon. Let's get it. We getting a little. Hold on, we getting a little smooth. Hey, we come on, come on. We getting a little. Hold on. Go, go. Who told you bad man don't dance? Who told you gangsters don't dance? Mm -hmm. Even with a weapon, my hip hop dance. Bad man taking over safe pan dance. Two left Who told you gangsters don't dance? Hold on. This is a real, I, I'm feeling real dance hall -y, that more of like a Caribbean vibe just from the flow, right? And then like, it's a great feature to get Drake on right now, just on his story. The story arc of Drake with his last album being real house music-y and real vibes-y, trying to have fun and, and like expand and mesh what we consider just to be rap, right? And so now like, you're getting just sonic amalgamations of so many different sounds from so many different cultures placed on maybe a uh, 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 Caribbean and strings with trap drums. We, music has became like just this beautiful ball of everything. And so this was just a different type of vibe. But I told you, gangsters don't dance, but we catch our little vibe over here. You hear me? Bad man, take another sip and dance. Two left feet, don't trip and dance. The girl want me, I might give her a chance. Give her a look, she give me a glance. You wore a tight dress just to enhance. You're like a bum bum. Never seen you before, what you gonna dance? You wore a tight dress just to enhance. You're like a bum bum. Never seen you before, where you come from? You got a fat bum bum. I got a long dress. I like them little dresses. That the shorties put on be thick as hell. Boy, you get in the crib, take that motherfucker off, look like a nigga. You be where that, where all that ass go, boy? Come on, man. You be ready to good game, bro. You know what I'm saying? But the dress had you thinking you was in there with Nicki Minaj, you hear me? I know I never met you at random. This must be destiny. That's why you're next to me. You feel like ecstasy. This must be destiny, it must no, be no. destiny. That's boom boom, I got a long Johnson. I know I never met you at random. This must be destiny, that's why you're next to me. You feel like ecstasy. This must be destiny, that's why you're next to me. You feel like ecstasy. Who told you bad man don't dance? Who told you gangsters don't dance? Even with a weapon, my hip hop dance. Bad man taking up a sip and dance. Two left feet don't trip and dance. The guy oh, it's left feet don't trip and Bro, it's such a just smooth vibe. I could definitely, definitely, definitely always be thinking of like random placements for music, but like Pink Panther or something soundtrack. Just something where like, this is a vibe and I have to be sitting back and experiencing this. While I do believe a song like this goes off in them clubs, especially when they show when the lit shorty shaking them like, ah, but soundtracks, things like that, because it's so clean and I feel like it's very digestible. And I feel like, although like we have Thames and like Afro beats and all these kind of things have hit, like I said, the world's music's just like a mesh now, right? But like, you sort of need a certain type of artist to ingratiate other places to sounds. And you need somebody who's pretty digestible. Like, I think Dave is, it would be great to be the guy who comes over and then people become fans of UK rap. Gets would never work because it's too abstract. It's too, it's, you need something that is digest. They're both super dope artists. I like Dave way more than Gets, but the, I'm not, Gets Fuego too, right? But you need somebody that's like, Dave raps in a way that your grandma can understand what he's saying. He's very just there with you. And the more you know, the better it gets. But I really do think Jay Huss would be a great guy to, what is, where is this nigga from? Somewhere in the UK, he's like, nigga gotta be like Jamaican, so shit. Me and my give her a chance, give her a look, she give me a glance. She wore a tight dress just to enhance. Touch my forehead, chest, left shoulder, then right side. Pray my brothers are good outside. I know the vibes, I know the vibes. Ah, no, Drizzy, shut the fuck up! <laughs> Let me get out of here, KBD Award. It's the one that didn't know. KBD Award goes to Drake. That nigga says, I pray my brother's good outside. That's Fendi. 
that's Fendi. I pray my, because when I am cuddled up with this little thing or that little thing or that little whoop, I'm still, you know what I'm saying, praying for my niggas. Usually not. I'm usually not actually thinking of my niggas in those moments. I'm going to be completely honest with you. But I commend him for it. Being able to what? Multitask. I got ADHD. Inside, praying my brothers are good outside. I know the vibes. I know the vibes. I know the vibes. Girl, one girl, stop rolling eyes. I find love and it slowly dies. So lie low, pie. Don't make my eye cry. Let me hold your controller. I'm not one of these controlling guys. I want you to touch roll. I'm not going to lie. I don't really like, like, it's like the auto tunes that's on his shit or something. Maybe it's the voice he's doing it. But the bars and that that control, like got the record control. I never really the bars are there, but there's just something about the distortion, or maybe it's how he's trying to talk and do it. I can't tell. Let me hold your controller. I'm not one of these controlling guys. I want you to touch roll with the girls, damn, and socialize and Oh, I know what it is. It's Drake does this thing, right? Where he's Canadian, right? Where that's my nigga. So I, I think that's really my favorite rapper, but currently. But yeah, no, he's a goat. But anyways, he does his lead. You know, Drake and start doing the Patois shit. Drake's still in there, start making a bad uh, accent and shit. At the... <laughs> no, he just. I think Drake just gets too submerged in the in what's going on, and the next thing you know, like nigga, I be catching myself, boy. When I ain't used to live in the south, nigga, I go to Texas, I come back with it, with a uh, double cup and some boots. Fuck is you talking about? It's just how it goes. Hey, alive, your backside is so fit, it opens eyes I know the vibes, I know the vibes Just cause I'm not jealous Doesn't mean I don't care That's just not fair I know you were trouble, I wasn't prepared If I were married, this might turn a scandalous affair Trouble is Oh uh, no, Drake, Drake hold you, Jay Hush That nigga gave you the most throwaway verse of all time What happened? It started off so good Trouble is there, trouble been right there, trouble is there. Trouble gon' find me anyway, trouble gon' find me, bubble and wine. Hey, trouble gon' find me, trouble will find me anyway. Okay, then he cooks up. It just got super walky in the middle, but then he cooked it back up. I ain't gonna lie because. He's just sort of crooning, just sort of having fun with the notes and the melodies. And I'm also, I don't know. What he's the line I was sort of joking before the line he made earlier was actually fire. Like while he's he's cuddled up with this girl, he still prays that his people. He's saying, as I as I ascend in this world, and I know that my life is no longer at risk. I never was. I was an actor, but like I'm in good situations, right? And some of the people that I care about and I love and I've met through this journey are, and I pray that God still protects you. Like, I pray that you still, that's a fuego bar. And then it did get a little, the low amen amount. But then it comes to the controlling guys. And then this one right here is cool too, but I can definitely tell he's just having fun with it. Not gonna lie. I was, this is heat, but what I, I pictured in my head, this just isn't it. I pictured more of Jay Huss doing the crooning and then Drake coming with the rapping. I didn't know that Drake would also be crooning, but it's not terrible. It's not terrible at all. And the beat, I don't know the, the beat is just so smooth and simple and hard. You have to sort of move. It's gonna find me, man. It always does. Come close, I'ma explode. Got leg carrying a heavy load. Mm. Why you wasting a semicircle? Mm. Getting money fast, must not a turtle. I oh, no. Wait, what? Why you wasting a semicircle? Getting money fast, must not a turtle. Had to go through so many hurdles. Block so hot like inferno. Had some issues that were internal. Mm. Had a mad life, I could write a journal. And that's but I, I love that. You know, you can never beat introspection in music because that is the point of it. And, um, Trouble always finds me. 
Uh, what's this bar right here? Oh, has some issues that were intern. Has some issues that were internal. Trouble always finds me. And I'll just use that one too. And I had some tr troubles that were, and I have some troubles that are internal, you know? Like being able to step away from yourself. And yes, we do. I have been in a lot of situations, right? Okay, so speaking personal, that have caused me to be in trouble, legal, or whatever, whatever kind of trouble, right? But then when you do do a bit of introspection, you do realize that a lot of this trouble though comes from me. So a lot of the reason is I'm putting myself in these situations. I like to be in these situations. I believe I believe I belong in these situations. So until you are able to do have that introspection and inner healing of like, nah, nigga, I'm the one wild. And it's me. It can't be, it can't always be everyone else. I'm a firm believer in that. It can't. Everybody can't be tripping. If if I've had to fight 10 people in my life and every one of those 10 people I fought. I'm the only person I they fought who's probably the problem. That's just, you know, a little honesty. <laughs> but the niggas I used to get out with, they used to get out with niggas. So I'll be fighting some good fighting ass niggas, boy. You ever fought so long, you had to like, bro, you, you good on this? Like, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, we getting down, boy. We, when you punch it like this, then you just, nigga. All right, bro. And you just walk home. you baby shopping on fashion over gear you little <laughs> look at it the club because i ain't never even supposed to know that that's really an ironing board back there this was a certified vibe i'm gonna give it one hand because there's a part some parts i didn't quite enjoy this was a certified vibe check it comes another reaction by me right here pink music video by me right here pink click on it show me some love and you watch this video so long you didn't click that thumbs up button oh my boy you're just a hoe so stop being a hoe kbd family love y'all salute i am gone